went to bed about 11.30. I checked the internet first to see how close the fire was. and I thought it was not real close, so I went to bed and was reading. And right at midnight, somebody beat on my door. And <laughs> they said, Mama Jo, we've got to go for a meeting down the hill. Said, grab maybe a change of clothes. And, and I thought, okay, I can probably go to the meeting and come back and get things. But when I got down by the dining hall and turned and looked back, because there were no trees down there, then I could see the fire coming over the hill and over the ridge there. And, and they wouldn't let me come back to get anything. We watched the fire. You know, from the parking lot of the Baptist Church, we could see the fire and we could tell it was coming. It was spreading so much. Just seeing down below, you know, my friends' places. And it's hard to find your own house when there's no landmarks, except I had that water tower. To, and then my little sign, 310. I knew this was mine. <laughs> It's all just stuff. It was only yesterday that we got back on the grounds, but we were just standing there looking, and then Billy Graham chaplains came and prayed with us. Everybody that comes prays, and I thank God for that. It's such a good feeling. And I know that God knew about this. He's in control. He has a reason for letting this happen. I'm just his maidservant, and I know he'll take care of me. And a lot of his kids are already taking care of me. Wow. Okay. I had gone to Africa several times, and that's why I went, to help. And, and now, now I'm on the other end, and it's, it's such a blessing. This looks like a plaque that I had about Jesus' footprints, the footprints in the sand. And we can read a little bit where it says, I will never leave you. And you know, the plaque says, you see the two sets of prints for a while, and then it goes down to just one, and you say, Lord, why did you leave me at that time? And that's when he was carrying me. <laughs> that's what this is about. That's when he carries us. There's just one set of prints. Oh, that's a good thing to find. <laughs> if you can't come and help, give. Give so that others can. That's what I plan to do. I probably can't go back to Africa anymore except just to go look and enjoy. But I can give and help. We're all in a family together, a big family together. and. And we all want to help. And, and people can feel it. And when I come here and, and see all of you precious people, and then when we pray together, you know, you know it's going to be okay. <laughs> <laughs>